Welcome back everyone to another exciting episode of Let's Play Artifact Adventure. I'm your host Mr. Gazillion and in the last episode I said I'd check this tower over here. Um, I did not verify between episodes to see if what we could take it on but you know what? I feel like we can or let's just take a peek. This is an open world game. Um, we don't have lots of options really and I mean at one point yeah you gotta explore. So, I know at one point we had to come here, and this this seems like a pretty intense level, to be honest. Ooh, Rise of Satan. We're gonna do some exploding moles for sure. Ouch. Yeah, these guys cause your bl a certain blindness, so... Okay, and they don't care about anything. Let's try Thunder Mouse then. They might be immune to magic, which is really unfortunate, really. Yeah, and of course... Okay, good. We can use Thunder against them. Oh, good XP. And the music here is really intense. We got it. Demon Hunters up... Ooh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Who got that? Alright, kill. Is this something you equip? Nope. A Silver Blade Bane to Demons. Alright, can you... What happens if you give it to... Who can equip it? No one can equip it. Let's see, if we give a medical herb to Kale, and then we go back to Kale, and we give the demon, demon hunter's sword to Ga, what happens? Can he equip it? Equip. This blade inflicts great pain on animals. A silver blade, Bane to Demons. Well, I think they're... Okay, so they're, they're essentially the equivalent, except one's good against animals and the other one's good against demons. And since we're in a demonic area... Ooh, Elixir of Fortitude. My goodness. Um, let's use it on... Uh, you know what? Let's give it to Kill. Because she could use it. I think... Oh, I think we might have actually given her extra HP, which is okay. Um, Ga tends to be pretty okay right now. In terms of defense and HP, he never gets really close to dying, so... And let's try a purifying... No, a light of redemption on a ghost, maybe? I'm just gonna do a spirit ember on the ghost. I don't feel like wasting that much. Oh, there we go. And we took care of it. So this actually is a pretty good place to explore, I think. A green key, nice. Do we need lots of these? Is this a key item? <laughs> a slight, slightly green key, okay. I wish I knew what it was for. Excuse me. Yeah, these are dungeons that we have seen before, so... Um, what's... Oh, is a fireball scarier than the Eye of Satan? <laughs> uh, questions we ask ourselves when playing these games, eh? So, I guess we'll take on the Eye of Satans with magic. And I don't think our... Ooh. Good, good. I don't think our um, magic relies on, on sight too much, so... We're okay. uh, now everybody's blind, of course. And Kyle missed twice. And butts to the rescue with a little ice magic on the fireball. There you go. Fortunately, I had to use a lot of MP. Ooh, wow, that's good XP though. And of course, everyone's gaining a level because of it. I'm okay with that. Ah, uh, yes. I actually wish we had uh, more items to, uh... sorry, not more items, I wish we had a, like an escape rope item. I don't know why there are none in this game. Ooh, a Vineborn. Okay, these seem like they'd be weak against fire, so we will try our explosion roll again. Ooh, and they're actually just very strong monster too. And they are not weak against... Let's try maybe... Um... Ice again? Let's just see. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm really not sure if Kyle's missing. 
or if... Uh, sorry, Butts is missing, or if it's just that they're immune to spells, because they both missed it, so I doubt that... Uh, I doubt it's a question of immu uh, of uh, missing as so much as a, it is a question of immunity. But a vine monster, in my opinion, should be weak. Should be weak against fire. And we'll do Thunder Mouse again. Uh, at least... Oh! Ugh, spoke too soon! Oh, and God being blind still managed to get through. That's good. Nice! Uh, come on, come on, come on. Kill can finish this off. Let's just try without... Without wasting too much... Aw, oh, man, that's actually quite a bit of... Oh. Okay, well... That thing had a lot more HP than I thought it would. And we gained a frickin' ton of XP, which is nice. Now let's just use some Healing Mist. I don't feel like using... Not two of them. Okay, do we have item space? I don't want to... Oh yeah, we got plenty of it. Another green key. Okay, so I guess we need multiple green keys to get to the end of this dungeon. We might actually leave before um, before going to the top floor, I'm thinking, because uh, I don't feel like uh, dying and then having to redo everything. Mm -mm -mm -mm. More treasures. Come on, treasure, 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 treasures. Yes, two of them, too. Nice. I hope it's equipment for everyone. We are getting, becoming pretty freaking strong now, actually. These things were kind of a tough uh, fight the first time we met them in the gem cave. There we go. 900 XP. Sage's hat. And Elixir of Wisdom. Butts, this is your lucky day! So, Wisdom. And, uh... I guess a sage's hat is for him. Oh! Aren't you happy? It's your birthday. It's your birthday, Butts. Oh, and he only has a hide cap, too, so this is a huge boost. Man, oh man. That's gonna raise his uh, MP, I think, too. Well, to celebrate, healing mist for everyone! I don't know, I don't think we really need to... Do we really need to go out and save and get ready? I don't think so. There we go. Nah, we're doing fine. We can keep going. These are the facts that we need to defeat the Swamp King. I don't really know what the green keys are for, though. They might be for this dungeon, or it just might be for the Swamp King's temple. Because they did mention that the Swamp King had a tower. You open the door using the green key. Oh, there you go. That explains it. Ooh, a plant. Let's explode. Ah, poison. Ah, ah. And they're unscathed again. Oh, butts, I guess, since everyone's always so freaking oh, immune to your stuff. There we go. Didn't even have the chance to heal. And we got a cleansing tonic. We'll hold on. No, actually, I don't want to hold on to it because um, I rather have mana, and this, they're not particularly expensive. And uh, you just give your everybody give your medical herbs to Kale. Give to Kale to Kale, and then Kale can use one on our good warrior Ga. And I don't think she really needs one right now. The other green key. Okay, it's getting kind of scary, actually. Come here, goblin. Jar goblin. Ooh, and a warp plant. Something tells me we should go for the warp plant first. And I'm gonna try again a spirit ember. Ooh, oh, it's been slowed. Okay, being slowed's not the end of the world, I think. I don't think, but I could be wrong. 
Let's try uh, ice, maybe. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Man, this guy's actually not that, not that strong. So, no worries. Okay. Ah, oh, man, one of these. You hear a voice from somewhere. I'm called Healing Do. If you're hurt, I can help you out. Gosh, shall I heal you? No. Um, I still think sh we should give it to our shaman. He well, somewhere I'm called Healing Do. If you're hurt, I can help. Butts, yes. Because I'm here. Butts gain the power of a new artifact, Healing Do. And so is it just an individual healing spell? Oops. Healing do heals one ally. Oh my goodness. That is very good too. Oh, there you go. Everybody's healed. Now we're actually very well equipped to take on a lot of stuff, honestly. Ooh. Are we well equipped enough to take on this guy? Butts? Nope. You. Kyle. Top off our warrior. I don't even care if we're wasting it. I don't want to waste more mana. 73 mana. Let's do this. Be gone with ye. Ooh, and a different bringer of despair attacked. Actually, I, I don't really like the sound of this. Oh man, all right, let's drop his defense, I guess. If there's any time we should be dropping his defense, it's now. And uh, I don't really think there's anything we should be doing here, except hurting him. Let's try, uh... Ah, oh, I didn't have time to read what that said. Okay, so... Let's just fight then, and let's use our healing do on Kale. Oh! You know, this is not bad. This is not bad. Like, he, do he hurts, but when he does that attack, we can just do healing mist and make up for it. So, 35, 35... So it's not great, but it kind of like offset the damage a little bit, so... And, uh... Well, you know what? I say we do some sort of other attack. How about blue tier? Nice! Nice! Oh yeah! This is a good turn. Okay, so ice magic, useless. Uh, I... Let's try fire magic. Ooh! Okay, fire magic is good. Kill. Save his ass. Butts, don't die on me. And while you wait... Actually, you you top off everyone if you can. Ooh, actually, he could still die. Fight and heal yourself to max. Because I don't want to... Heal yourself to max before he does? Uh, I, actually that's not bad. Okay. Okay, I'm okay with that. We are getting low on MP though. Healing mist! Come on, let's keep doing... Let's do well. Don't miss, people! Uh, actually, yeah, do this. I'm okay, that's not very strong. Yes! Yes! This is what I wanted. Oof. Huh. Yay! And that's an artifact we need, I'm sure of it. Um, oops, you use that on yourself. And actually, I don't think we really need it on anyone else. Destroy the ad artifact? You know it. Bam! All right, we did some damage to the Dark Lord. <laughs> you think you can stop me? Did you not see me kick that guy's ass? Um, though I'm not sure I should be using any spells unless it's to heal a little bit of everyone. Yeah, let's do a little healing mist while we're at it. Uh, it's not very strong, but whatever. Just attack. Oh, that hurts. 
I hope nobody hits. Oh no, not her, not her, don't die. Okay, Kyle, uh, Kale, heal yourself, please. You're the fastest one in the team. Kyle, do you actually have a medical herb? Yes, please do it on Kale as well. Oh, phew. I'm glad that happened. All right, we can do this. And Butts, you actually use a healing dew on Kale. Kale, come on, it's not because you weak it, you can start missing. And earlier when I thought that maybe... Ooh, nice, nice. Level ups all around, that's what we want. Earlier when we said we didn't really need to go out to uh, restock up on items. While that was the truth, because we did survive, uh, maybe it wasn't the right truth? You know, what I'm, if you get what I'm saying? Let's do one blue tier, because these guys actually can hurt quite a bit. Or at least they can hit everyone. That's exactly what I'm And this guy can just take regular hits. There you go. Kyle's doing a good job. And Gog got his level up. Kind of wish this game described what kind of bonuses you get every time you get a level up. And Kyle's, uh... Kyle's not the fastest. Do I have more than one key? The seal bearing the royal crest. See, that's funny because... Oh no. I, I only recall using one key. Uh... These guys are tough. I should probably run. Let's try. Ah, yes. Good. Alright, let's head to Loot and Trek. Ah, uh, yes. We're back home. Safe and sound. And we're actually gonna go return to Goblin, uh, the Jar Goblin while we're here, because why not, right? Yes, <laughs> I do want to save, thank you. Oh man, how- okay, we just gained, uh, levels, so we're at a- yo, that's- at 7,000 XP, it takes a while to gain a level, but I mean, we were gaining those levels pretty quickly, like, I mean, if we were, you know, on the big battles, we were gaining close to over a thousand, uh, Per level and butts you get a few and let's give Kyle a few but honestly we don't really need to stock up I'd rather go buy some of the good ones and it's just out of curiosity okay no they never get new stuff so I guess really we've got to rely on um, on uh, caves for better equipment from now on I mean we might find you know we might find uh, a, new, a town that sells good stuff, but I don't recall uh, seeing any in a while. So yeah, so I don't know what this equipment here does. This is locked, but I do know that uh, you had the choice between the three treasures. Oh my god, so many of them. And now we have, what, nine? Uh, yes. So that means he's got 26 now. Let's go see if we can unlock one of the doors again. Uh, yeah, so the key of time allows you to talk to the sages. Oh man. Ah, uh, what? How many did we capture? I thought we had 26. Or is it 24? Can I not count? Oh yeah, that's 24. I can't count. Sorry guys. Um, yeah, so, and the, the other one is you can actually get, um, sorry, what am I thinking of? Yes, artifacts. You can get four artifacts, but they're not that amazing, really. One's like, raises your strength by 10, your attack by 10, your defense by 10. Um, I think your MP by 10, and then your, um, uh, yeah, like mana maybe by 10. Like, it's n nothing fantastic. I mean, after gaining a few levels, I mean, I don't know. I feel like it does, it's not, not really game breaker, while an airship is really useful. Ah, uh, that's actually not what I meant to do. I meant to save. Sorry, guys. Um, while the key of time might be useful, I don't really know, because I mean, all the sages I think say different things, so... This goes to show we don't really, really, really know. I'd like to know what this castle does. Is it another castle or is it a dungeon? And are they t how difficult are they? Um, we do know that there's a... past the desert, there's a forest, and we need to get a poison from here. Ooh, and there's another village. It's an inn here. 
Is there a weapon shop? Since it's night, there might be a jar goblin dancing around. Maybe somebody will buy some ore around here? Nope. Nobody wants to talk to us. Guess we're not cool enough. Mixer of magic. Alright, I like that. Let, uh... Raises MP. Yeah, I'd like butts to have that. You know, we could actually give that to our... Uh, to our warrior as well. Okay, nobody wants to talk to us here either. Oh, there's our char goblin. Ah, we actually could go. Here lies the Meza Kozigi. Hmm. That's kind of ominous. The door's locked. There's really nothing to be seen around here. Unless we go during the day? I don't feel like spending money, I, and I don't trust them to not mug me in the night because nobody wants to talk to me. So let's use Kyle's one ability, Sun and Moon. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be anyone else, eh? Unless, could the door be unlocked during the day? No, okay. Mysterious. Very mysterious. But, you know what? We found the one jar goblin, and that's enough to uh, get ourselves a new treasure. And it's a treasure, right? So it could be a weapon, it could be equipment, who knows? Let's do it, since we're right there anyway. And I think afterwards we should go check out the forest, see if we're strong enough to try and... Uh, uh, strong enough to, to get to uh, the poison, because the poison will allow us to kill that creature that we agreed to kill, because... You know, they're rare, but extremely dangerous, and they can raise a whole freaking village. Alright. Yes. No, I'm not ready. Let's go open that up. Let's see what we've got. What the heck? Did I not give, give it to him? Oops. My bad. So far, you've caught 24. Oh, yes, sorry. There we go. No. Come on, come on. How many do we need for this side? You need 35. So you get the soldier's garment. Choose once and choose well is written on the door. So soldiers. Um, and this is a robe of the barbarians. Hmm. Angel staff. Ooh. Yes, yes, yes. I like the sound of that because I think when you have a staff, you can actually use it to cast. Oh my god. 18 and. But my god, in the last two episodes. Actually, yeah, in the last two episodes, you've gained so much stuff. So much stuff. Oh my god. Let's go sell the rest. He's gained three items, I think, in the last two episodes. He's hogging everything. And then we have to choose between the soldier's gear or the barbarian's gear. I always do this. It's not the right way. It's a tough decision to make, but I think the soldier's gear might be the right idea. Because barbarian might up your attack but lower your defense, while soldier seems like it's more balanced. And, uh, Kale doesn't really need more def uh, attack, if you ask me. So let's sell Butts' staff and his hide cap. Does anybody have old equipment that we want to sell? You know what? Let's sell the arrows. I don't really need them right away. And while the hunter's blade gives a lot of money, we don't really need it, and I'd rather hold on to it. Oh, we can sell this then. Okay, there you go. I thought we had to find a special character to sell it to, but no. So uh, I'm feeling pretty good about this. Yes. What does the angel staff do? No one knows. Alright, let's go explore this. Um, oh, here's another tower. Yeah, I feel this tower would be too difficult for us, though. Oh no, is it night yet? I don't think so. Okay, so let's see one battle. Elixir of Magic. And, uh... 
The Elixir of Magic raises boost MP by 5. Yeah, let's do it on this guy again. No. God, I'm nervous. Yep, nervous for that reason. Rock Core. Um, let's try Explosion Molt. Oh, dodge, 51, 59. Yeah, that, that hurts. But we're doing decent. Bleh. Okay, so maybe this is not actually that dangerous. That was an XP. That's a lot of XP, though. So maybe it is dangerous and we just got lucky. I'm going to go to the right because that seems like the correct thing to do. And that looked like a dead end, but maybe if we step on it, there's something. Hmm. Okay, I don't like this at all. Stoneworm. They tend to... Let's try a Spirit Ember on the Rock Core. Yeah, okay, I'm I'm happy with this kind of damage we're, we're dealing. Uh, Kyle, you actually finished that Rock Core, and we're going to do another Ember on... Ow. Okay, that did not finish it off, actually, and I was kind of hoping that it would. Kyle, you actually do it on the Rock Core this time, and you know what, let's... You use your Angel Staff. Let's see what it does. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, that defends them, okay. Oh, I mean, no. I don't want to spend any more mana in one. Oh, come on, come on, finish him off. Why is it taking so much time? There you go. Yeah, I already took quite a bit of a beating there, so, uh... Oh, what? We didn't... Oh, skill, sorry. Actually, we didn't fill up on medical herbs like I thought we did. You give yours to Kale. Oop, not Kyle. Damn it. To Kale. And Kale, you use them. Because as a samurai, you seem to be the only really good class. <laughs> there you go. And any poison here? Nope. Any over here? Oh. Uh, the Goblin Kings? I don't like the sound of that. Goblins are always really tough. And they always seem like they're immune to magic. I'm gonna try ice. Okay, so they didn't like ice, but they all everyone missed here, but we'll try ice again. Damn, someone's confused. At least Ga hurt himself in the process. Uh, no, you hold on to your mana for now. See if we can just... There you go. That's exactly why. There you go. Okay, good. Maybe Buzz should be on healing duty for now. There you go. Not too dangerous now that we have a healing ability, eh? It's kind of nice. Ooh, there's a goblin over there. I hate doing this, but... We've discovered in the past the ability to... Uh, explosion... Oh, it actually hurts everyone? I'm okay with that. Oh, wow. That's actually very good. Um, you heal yourself once. There you go. Fully healed. I do this because we have we have discovered monsters in the past. And items. Uh. Well, you try one explosion roll, because it is on everyone. That was actually freaking good. Butts you heal, though. On Ga, because he's taking a lot of damage. Come on, guys, finish him off. Uh... Good. Ooh, yeah. I don't want to waste too much. There you go. Yay, level ups. Good. And some heals all around. There we go. 
Poison berries, yes. Wait. Oh yeah, I gotta use that thing, eh? What was it again? Was it the gauntlet? What was it? Oh yeah! So... Do I have a... First of all, do I have the... No, I do not. Does he have it? No, he does not. Alright, so first of all, let's use a... A cleansing tonic, because I don't want to waste too much... Too much on this. And I think who has the... Is it her? Yes. So kill. Yes. There you go. And let's keep going. I wish there was a way to get out of here. There's one area we didn't explore. Which was a little bit to the top of it. I think we might have just enough mana. Yeah, we got plenty of mana to explore it. So I think it was just by going top here. Is there any treasure? Uh, there might be. There might be. Come on. Yes! So we got healing staff. Um, let's give it to... But, which is not as good, but, you know, he can use it in battle. That's what shamans do. They use their staffs to, uh, to heal people, which I like. Oh. Come here. Come here. Yeah, we got him. Yo, this actually goes really far. Nice. You hear a voice from somewhere. I am the gates of hell. With me by your side, your ally shall not, shall not fall into the nether. Shall I shall bring them back. Gah, shall I watch over you? No. A foolish choice. No, it's not. It's because I want butts to have you. Uh, it's weird, it's very well. But to gain the power of a new the Gates of Hell. It's a really ominous name, though. Gates of Hell. Bring it down, ally, back to his feet. Yes! Guys, we're like equipped to take on anything now. We're not even, a wor we're not even afraid about death anymore. Now, if only, you know, I must not die. Um on the way back, but uh, this is amazing. If I do die, I don't even have to worry about losing money. I go to Loot and Trek, I use uh, the inn, get my MP, revive everyone, then just uh, just use the inn again. And voila, we're done. Uh oh. Okay, this is the guy we had seen over there that I wanted to talk to. He's gonna ask us to not to uh, kill that creature. He better be pretty persuasive, if you ask me. Ah, you have a poison berry. Okay, leave the berry down over there. Then could you please leave? There's only a few of these beasts left in the world. Could you really want to help kill such a rare creature? Oh man, that's a really tough decision. There's no real right answer. I mean, they're, they're almost extinct, yet they can destroy villagers on their own. Um, I'm gonna say yes because they're so dangerous and I agreed to kill it. I don't want it to destroy a village later on. How how could you? Very well, you give me little choice. This is my last resort. What? What did he do? I'm sorry, dude. It's not that I wanted... What? I hope he didn't attack that little place. I think it's over here. Oh, there he is. Thanks, thanks to that idiot. It almost got out. No response. It's like he's dead. Damn it. So it was that nature-loving freak who kept attacking us. Not only did that, but the dead men rose up, drew weapons, and attacked us. I never imagined it would come to this. Uh, anyways, thanks for the berry. Here. It's not a lot, but... 25,000. That's actually quite a bit. Now I can finally head back to the castle. And at 10,000 experience points. Yeah, no shit, everyone's gonna gain levels. Uh, oh man. I, I didn't really want him to die either. Dude, come on. Alright guys, well I'm gonna end the episode here. Uh, that was a fun adventure uh, filled uh, uh, episode. 
Um, in the next episode, well, we're kind of lost, really. We don't really know what we're doing, but I am going to figure out what we're going to do. And we're going to do it, I guess. So as always, I'm your host, Mr. Gil Gazillion. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye now. Hey guys, thank you very much for watching my video. I appreciate every single view. If you enjoyed what you watched, feel free to take a look at the next video or peek at a random video. Don't forget to subscribe. See you guys next time.